Accepting Failures Success and failure are the two sides of the same coin. We appreciate one because of the other. The day is bright and beautiful because the night is dark and dense. If there were no nights, we would not have understood the beauty of the day. No one wants to fail, we always want to succeed. But it does not happen always. The world has not seen a single person who had always been successful in everything he did. Most often success has followed a series of failures. If one gives up at the first taste of failure, one will perhaps never taste success. It is necessary to learn to handle success and failure in a balanced way. We must take them in our stride. The saying is hope for the best and be prepared for the worst. Efforts made are more important than the results achieved. Fruits of action should not be our sole motive. Success is not everything in life nor a failure is the worst calamity. Learning to accept defeat is in itself a success. One should not lose courage and confidence in adverse situation. Defeats or failures have many lessons to teach. A close study of them will help one to succeed better. Much can be learned from failures. The lives of discoverers, inventors, explorers, scientists and of all great men are filled with failures and defeats. Their success story is filled with numerous failures. They learn to convert their failures into pillar of success. A person who cannot accept defeats is proud and self-conceited. He is much concerned of vanity and brings doom for himself. There is every chance of such a person using all possible dishonest means in order to succeed. For him nothing matters except success. For him means justify the end. He may lie, he may cheat, he may bluff, and he may resort to every heinous brutality in order to avoid a defeat and to achieve success. But there is no merit in such a success. A thousand honest defeats or failures are better than a single dishonest success. A person who cannot accept defeat has no value for honesty, sincerity or loyalty. In fact, he has no values in life. Let us learn to accept defeats in the proper way. Of course we should try to convert them into success. Our motto should be, fighting is more important than winning. Let us fight to win but be at the same time prepared to lose. Megha was a very intelligent girl. She used to come first in her class. This happened year after year until she reached class 8. In the final examination of CISS 8, she lost her position. She had to be satisfied with the third rank. She could not accept this situation and became very upset. It gave her such a shock that she had to be admitted to a hospital. The nervous shock affected her so much that the very thought of the examination became a nightmare for her. In spite of long treatment, she was never the same again. Her performance came down drastically and in the board examinations, she just managed to scrape through with the bare minimum. But if she had accepted sincerely her third rank in class 8, she would have been able to keep her moral high and might get the first position back in coming examinations.